How are you? I'm good, thanks. And you? How are you? I'm pretty good, thanks. And you? How are you? I'm very well, thanks. And you? What is English? Mukad English sikhiyani. English is a language. English sikhiyani bashavak. Why do we need a language? Ay apne bashavak kone to communicate. Kata karanne te. What do we communicate? Mono adapi kata karanne. Actions, kriyaval. Actions we did in the past. Ati te kala kriyaval. Actions we are doing now. Then karana kriyaval. Actions we will do in the future. Anagate karana kriyaval. We are gonna do. We are going to do. Okay, there are three sentences. Vakya tunak tiyanava. Now, what's the verb? Mukadda kriya pade. Hitiya, innava, hindivi. Verb changes. Kriya pade venasvela. Ekama vakya. Aita pusik, aita pusik, aita pusik. Namut, verb changes. Kriya pade venasvela. Why? Hitiya. Atite kriyavak. Isra hitya den nehe. Past tense. Innava now den innava. Hindi vi in future. Anagate di puse hindi vi. But now then there isn't a cat. Then nehe. So when we talk about past actions, the verb changes. When we describe actions are happening now, verb changes. When we talk about future actions, verb changes. Welcome to the English Master YouTube channel. Today we are gonna learn Adapi Ganagane Anne Present continuous, present progressive. It's exactly the same. They, they can make a samana. Cambridge books uses present progressive, and the local books and the American books mostly uses present continuous. What is present continuous? Mokak the present continuous kiani, emanetang, present progressive kila kiani. Look at this timeline. According to this timeline, it illustrates me timeline nikim pennum karani mehe deng at the moment of speaking right now at this moment menna me mohota me loke arambe sita me 2050 dedas pana ekyan anagate me kata karana mohota at this moment metanin idiriyata tiyenne anagate me atite it is a present continuous or present progressive at this moment menna me katha karana mohote di sidu ena kriyawal actions are happening now okay right now at this minute me mohote mama ogolanta english ugannanawa i am teaching english now i am not Playing Mama then Krida Karanine at this minute, me mohote. Me mohote ogolo mukadda karanne. What are you doing? You are learning English. English bashav iginaganava. Me mohote ogolo TV balanne. You are not watching TV. So, when do we use present continuous? How do we use present continuous? Present continuous, koi mohte the bavita karan noni, koi vage the bavita karan noni kila, then ogolanta terenwa. Actions are happening now. Mehe mohte vena kriyaval, vistra kirima sanda. Present continuous or present progressive. Second rule, deveni nitiya. Okay? Actions are happening now. Me mote siduina kriyaval sanda. Okay, earlier that's what I have told you. Kaling ematamai monkey. Namut, deveni niti edi. In the second rule, uh, let me little bit expand this movement. Okay, right. So actions are happening 
around this movement. Example, Udaharanya Katiate. Two weeks ago, I bought a book. Sati Dekata Kalim Mama Potak Miladi Gatta. Okay? At this minute, I have not finished it yet reading. Mama Eka Tama Kiyavala Iverane. At this minute, May Mohote, I am not reading it. Mama Eka Kiyavan Nitne. Okay? Now, I am reading the book. Okay? Sati Dekata Kalim Gatti. Two weeks ago, I bought. Okay, uh, let's say yesterday I read the chapter 2. Okay, three days ago I read the chapter 1. Me kriyava anagate in the future will happen. So, the second rule is present continuous we used to talk about the actions we have not finished yet. It is a devani nithya, present continuous, present progressive, api bhavita karani, ivara vela neti kriyaval vistira kirima sandha. Udaharanya khatiyata. Another example, second example. Six months ago, masa ayakata kaling, I lost my job. Mage rasava neti una. At this minute, I am not looking for a job. Me mohate mamarasava koyanine namut tavamat. I have not get, got a job. Tavamat madarasava klebunine. Again, tavamat mamarasava hoyaming pavatineva. So, eva ge deva lapi vister karanit ne mai. Udar nekati de oya. You are looking for a job. Tavam ubarasava soyaming pavatine. Me kata karana mohate rasava koyanine. Me kata karana mote ingrisi gana gana wa namut thawama rassavak soyaming pavatina wa. So eveni kriyavan vistara kirima sandhaat api present continuous bhavita karana wa. Third rule. Tungeni nithya. When do we use? How do we use present continuous? Kohuma da api bhavita karani. Koi velavad da api bhavita karani. Present continuous. Okay. Action happened, happened, are happening now, will happen in the future. So it's a, a series of actions. Usually, Samaning, when we talk about habits, api purdugena kata karanukuta, we use simple present tense, not present continuous. We do not use api bhavita karanine, present continuous. Purudu gana katha karan. But when we talk about bad habits, api naraka purudu gana katha karan Oh, uh, something irritates us, something uh, shocking. Api ve kope dana vana de aksidu ena vana nitara nitara. It constantly happening. We use present continuous or present progressive. Eveni dea kata karan at api bhavita karan ni present continuous. That action is not happening at this minute. Ema kriyava me muhute siduen ni ne. But mega nithara nithara kriya siduena kriyava liak. Example, they are constantly gossiping about me. Ego lu nithara mage veradi kata karan wa. Not Right at this minute, me mohte ni ni. Namut mega nitara nitara venus kriya vaniyak. Notice, did you notice in this sentence constantly? I have written in red kalama maratu paining liya latino. Make kriya visheshaniya adverb bekak. In the second example, she is always coming to class late. It irritates us. It disturbs. Always here notice adverb. It is an adverb. So when you talk about uh, something behavior, irritates us or uh, 
it's a bad habit you use present continuous but remember you have to use an adverb kriya visheshanayak bhavita kalayutu there's a one more rule i should teach you tava eka neetiyak thiyena mama ogulanta kiyala dennone predetermined actions e kiyanne kalin salasum karala thiyena kriyawa anagathe karanna planned future actions anagathe karanna thiyena kriyawa kalin sudanam karala thiyenne now usually when we talk about future actions samanyen api anagathe kriyawal karanna yana kriyawal sandan karanukota we use future tense future tense thamai api bhavita karanne present continuous uth api bhavita karanawa matha anagathe me me matha kadi me satiyak kathulata so when we talk about in the near future what we are going to do we use present continuous okay example he is visiting his parents next week we are eating at a restaurant tonight in the near future not next year next month ilanga avurudde ilanga maase nemi in the near future when you talk about predetermined actions you are going to do in the near future you use present continuous anagate karanne yana sieluma kriya sandha future tense bhavita kala ki present continuous sa present progressive bhavita karanna puluwan me math anagate di karanne yana kriya sandha Thank you very much for watching English Master YouTube channel. Give us a thumbs up, subscribe us, leave a comment. See you on next week. Bye bye.